frost and below freezing temperatures as Glasgow hit with coldest night of autumn. Get the latest local news straight to your inbox every day. Guy Fox night was the coldest of autumn this year, with Glasgow and its surrounding areas waking up to frost-covered cars on Monday morning. Temperatures plummeted as low as 1C in the city overnight, and struggled to get above freezing 0C during the morning rush hour. But that still lagged behind the coldest night of 2017, when 10.1C was recorded on January 30 in Bremer, Aberdeenshire. And it is still some way off the coldest November temperature of last year, when 12.1C was registered, again in Bremer. Good morning cause are here for a chilly frosty start for some. Here's a few 0600 temps 4C Eskdale Muir 3C Aboyne 2C Edinburgh 0C Glasgow, BBC Scotland weather at BBC Scott weather November 6, 2017 A largely cloudless night failed to insulate the land and allowed heat to escape, leading to the widespread frost, Met Office forecaster Ollie Clayton said. Most of the Glasgow and its surrounding will remain largely bright and chilly for the rest of the week, with highs of around 12C towards the end. But clouds, wind and rain will be felt across parts of Scotland and the far northwest, moving into Northern Ireland and Western Wales and Western England by Monday night, according to the Met Office forecast. The band of rain and wind will then move slowly southeast, pulling cooler air down with it. Frosty conditions may be seen, particularly in central areas, Mr Clayton added. Dry for many, but becoming increasingly wet and windy in the northwest. Here's Causer with today's first look at Scotland weather. Pick.twitter.com asks OSWNX BBC Scotland weather at BBC Scott weather November 6, 2017 Wednesday and Thursday will remain largely dry in the south and southeast, but rain is likely to persist in the northwest. For the south on Friday and Saturday, it will be fairly brisk with showers moving in from the west with periods of sunshine mixed in, Mr Clayton added. He said the slow-moving cold front is spinning off a low-pressure system. As we move closer to the weekend the system starts to pull cooler air from the northwest down, bringing a cooler feel. It's also responsible for the showery setup we're likely to see on Friday. Then, there will be fairly widespread blustery cold showers across the UK with periods of brightness mixed in. It is too early to predict confidently what conditions will be like from Sunday onwards, the Met Office added.